Hi guys, Janelle Yasso here. Welcome to Janelle Yasso Vlog. So tomorrow we have a live performance at Columbia Lakefront Festival and I'm really excited because this will be our first live performance in front of an audience since COVID and oh my gosh, I just can't wait. We have been doing virtual concerts, which it's been nice, but it's nothing quite like being in front of a live audience. I personally believe that live music is supposed to be enjoyed with an audience. But anyway, uh, we are about to rehearse for uh, tomorrow's gig. And I decided to do a little bit of multitasking since I have so much to do this weekend. But before I get into that, uh, let me invite you to subscribe to my channel if you have not done so already. If you enjoy my music or my content in general, please also make sure you subscribe and hit the notification button. I'm bold, I'm strong. So let me tell you what's going on with this whole multitasking thing. My band and I performed the song on stage titled Bakasi. And whenever we perform the song, we always invite the ladies, mostly the ladies, men come out too, but mostly the ladies to come up stage and perform with us. And as an incentive for them coming on stage to perform with us, we give them uh, free waist beads. And when I say perform, I mean dance, not like to sing or anything. They usually come and we'll teach them like one or two dance steps and they'll join along and dance with us. So stuff like that, not actually singing. But anyway, that was a sidebar. <laughs> so like I said, as an incentive for them coming up stage to dance with us, we give them free waist beats. And I decided that I'm going to be rehearsing with the band and also working on the waist beats as well. Because like I said, I have so much to do. And yeah, I just have to multitask that way. And what I'm going to be doing with the waist beats is just identifying like the different sizes, like small, medium, large, extra large, stuff like that. All right, so without further ado, let's get started. Guys, are you ready? One, two. Monotonous. Can it be coming and going? Yes, you remember what I told you about varying it. Go play up, play down. Play up, play down. You always have to tune the up. Yeah, but can, can it, can it still be coming in and out? Or... Yeah, yeah. So remember. Maybe the intro and the chorus. When you get to the, we do the intro. We do the intro with it. We do the chorus with it. But the um the verse, you go and play the organ and you just play like melodic, like high life lines. So let's go. One, two, the high life line. What you're playing is too, is too staggering. It has to be like 
very, very, you know, steady. It's not consistent. You go, da, 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 da. You can't do that. It should come in the chorus and the hook. If not, everything is gonna sound too scanty. You want it, you know, you want the tension to rise mm -hmm. during the during the uh, the chorus, mm -hmm. then intensify during the during the hook. Okay, yeah, let's do that. Thank <laughs> you. 
Just signal us and we will follow you. Okay. Maybe hurry up. We have, we have to be a choir rehearsal. Okay. And hey, this one is good. Okay. All right. Let's. So we do jump, boy. Okay. All right. You're playing it straight, straight, four four reggae. Not every reggae is like that. So you can do this. That's one, and this is another one.